module on about DranView covers the DranView versions. So DranView is available in three versions, DranView 7 XP, DranView 7 Pro, and DranView 7 Enterprise. Uh, DranView 7 was introduced around the same time HDPQ has, and it, it really brought to light a lot of additional capabilities in 64-bit. Um, it can handle very large databases. It was updated to include the new Microsoft or newer at the time, Microsoft Ribbon uh, bar. So you will see it's a, it's been around for a while. It's in its seventh revision, but that revision really modernized the software package. So um, what's the difference between these three different versions? Well, first of all, DranView 7 XP, which was introduced uh, around September last year, was introduced at the same time as our Dran Expert product. It is only available or only compatible, I should say, with our Dran Expert product. So uh, if you purchase Dran Expert, you can get DranView 7 uh, XP as a free download, and that is the viewer for our Dran Expert product. Most of our customers are running DranView 7 Pro and DranView 7 Enterprise. Both of these products are compatible with all of our current and in fact, most of our legacy uh, Dranit's portable products. Within the capability of what those products do, DranView is a viewer for that. So uh, today uh, it's available certainly with our HDPQ product line, our Plus, our SP, as well as uh, legacy products such as the PX5 family, um, the, uh, the 4300 family, Power Platform, uh, different products like that in our energy platform. So DranView 7 Pro is compatible with all of those products. In addition to those products, our, our current products and our legacy products, DranView 7 Enterprise is also compatible with other products using some file import capabilities as it has. Um, so Comtrade, PQDIF, you can just import CSV and text files in addition to that other file formats. And basically this is compatibility with other products that are out there, okay? so. It's of course a viewer for the Dranit's product line, but you can bring in information from other products if you if you choose. So how do you get DranView 7? As I said before, DranView 7 XP, again, only for use with the Dran Expert product line, is free and unlicensed. There is no license to it. That's in contrast to DranView 7 Pro and DranView 7 Enterprise, uh, where there's a USB HASP key that uh, manages a license. DranView 7 XP is free and unlicensed, is available as a download from dranets.com on our support page, okay? Um, so again, it's only for use with Dran Expert. If you own Dran Expert, then uh, you can certainly download that free of charge. DranView 7 Pro, uh, which includes again, the uh, USB HASP license is included at no charge in most Dranets HDPQ, Visa Plus and SP packages. So. We kit in DranView to virtually all of the packages that we offer, our product packages, um, and our current product line is the HDPQ package or the HDPQ product. So DranView 7 Pro is, in, is included with the entry level uh, of those packages, which has our HDPQ Visa instruments, again, plus or SP. So it is also available for individual purchase. So if you're uh, a legacy customer and you need another copy of DranView Pro, you can certainly purchase that. But if you're buying modern kits or, or current kits, it comes free of charge. Uh, DranView 7 Enterprise having additional features is kitted in all of our other packages for our HDPQ line. So our guide, our explorer, our explorer 400 plus, and our SP packages all include DranView 7 Enterprise. So again, just to repeat, Pro is included with our Visa kits. DranView 7 Enterprise is included with everything else, our Guide, our Explorer, and our Explorer 400 Plus. However, if you purchase uh, a Visa with, um, with that comes with DranView 7 Pro, for a nominal free fee, you can also upgrade um, to uh, DranView 7 Enterprise from Pro. We just get the license information from your key and uh, we issue you an upgrade for that. That's something that actually tech support handles. So, so what are the differences between DranView 7 versions? Again, uh, DranView 7 XP, Professional and Enterprise are the three versions. However, XP and Professional are very close to each other. Actually, Professional, I'm sorry, DranView XP is kind of a lighter version of DranView Pro, but for the most part, they share the same feature set. And where they are different, I have highlighted them here. Um, 
just note that regardless of what version that you have, uh, the it, basically DrainView comes with an extremely powerful feature set. You can look at all of your data from your instruments. You can look at events. You can look at waveforms. You can change the parameters that are there. Um, there's a report writer that comes along with all of the uh, all of the versions. So it's a very powerful feature set just starting with XP and Pro. Enterprise adds to that feature set and adds more advanced tools and more annotation tools. So that's basically, if you, if you sum it up, those are the differences between XP and Pro and Enterprise. It's the advanced capabilities of Enterprise, but Professional is extremely capable. In fact, much more capable than virtually any other package that's available on the market. So in general, what you get are scrollable rubber band and chart axes. We'll talk about that today. Um, you can redo and undo different things that you do. Again, just like in a Word file um, where you can undo and redo. You can look at your diagrams. You can look at trends, waveforms, magnitude duration charts. Maybe that's a Sabima chart or something like that. Um, there's a chart area marking tool we'll demonstrate today. Um, you can even have templates for how you'd like to view the data and save those off and recall them later um, so you don't have to configure DranView every time you start it. You can have event filtering, which sorts by the event type. Uh, however, in DranView Enterprise only, you have the much more customization capabilities where you can drag and drop charts. I want a min-max chart, I drag it into there. I want to insert pictures and photos, I can drag it in there. I, I want floating annotations, which means that I can put an annotation on a waveform and say, well, maybe this is where the breaker opened or this is where we had the PQ event. You can write it in your own terms. Um, you can also customize the look and feel of DranView, the toolbars, the shortcuts, different things like that. Um, these are things that are only available in DranView Enterprise, and we'll be talking about these in the next two. We're highlighting these in the next two web meetings that we have on the intermediate and the more advanced topics. Continuing along, we have the file and system features. They both support um, you know, XP slash professional and enterprise all support large files. Um, there is a file compression format that's used to help reduce the, the size of the files once you save it off into the DranView file format. Again, you'd read it in the, in the native instrument file format for the first time and then have the ability to save it off in a DranView format. Uh, all the packages, uh, with the exception of XP, have automatic updates via the internet. So once you register, it'll actually, uh, DranView checks automatically by default every seven days. Um, if there's an update available, and if so, you have the ability to download that update. Or you can always go to our website and we have the latest version available for both XP and um, the professional and enterprise. Um, it's important to note that XP is a separate installation that is a different version of DranView. Professional and Enterprise, they're the same installation. What tells DranView what version you have and that you own is that HASP key, okay? That again, works with, with Professional and Enterprise. So there is no difference in that. You will see one download for Pro and Enterprise. Um, so you also have compatibility with older versions of DranView. Uh, again, an enterprise can read data from Comtrade files, from maybe protection relays. They can also read PQ diff and some other file formats. So getting into report writing, <clears throat> excuse me, every version of DranView has report writing capabilities. Um, DranView Enterprise adds additional capabilities um, beyond those that are available in Pro. So they all have the basic report writer module. You can monitor specific, uh, or you can customize your reports for different monitoring modes that the instrument happened to be in. Um, they all have an integrated text editor, again, with the exception of DranView 7 XP, <clears throat> which basically means you can, you can put your stuff in an RTF format and modify it, or a Word format. You have that ability to do that. However, Enterprise um, has additional features. Um, again, like the, the snapshots and the bookmarks, we'll cover these in, in uh, future DranView trainings. Uh, this, uh, uh, event selections, uh, different custom reports, G, uh, G54, which is a UK report. We are working on G55 as we speak, uh, for those of you who are in the UK. NVE standards, Chinese standards, um, multi-site reporting. Again, things that are only available in DranView Enterprise. So DranView Enterprise also offers something what's called multi-site. That is actually very powerful for 
um, large monitoring projects or even medium to large monitoring projects. So um, let's say you're in a facility and you're, you're doing an acceptance test or even troubleshooting and you've got multiple instruments. If you use DranView Pro, you can certainly look at all that data, but they are individual instances of that data. So you can load in site one, site two, but they don't really interact together, they're individual. DranView Enterprise can treat up to 16 simultaneous data sets as one. So you can compare the voltage on instrument one to the voltage on instrument two to instrument three and basically put them right on the same screen and you can see the effects as maybe a power quality event ripples through your facility or a substation or whatever it could be. So it really kicks it up a notch as far as the capabilities of, uh, of DranView to do uh, analysis on multiple instruments at one time. Um, all versions of DranView with the exception of DranView XP have what's called the rescue kit. And that's for the, uh, the gotchas where you forgot to set the time, maybe the wrong time zone, or you just completely forgot to set it. You can adjust the time and you can slide it around. Uh, maybe you forgot to put in the, the current probe scale factors correctly. Um, you forgot that you were connecting to a CT. So you want to multiply and scale all of your current measurements by a particular value. Flip CTs, you accidentally have the arrow point in the wrong direction, different things like that. So these are things that can be corrected uh, within the, um, the rescue kit. And that makes that quite easy. And last but not least, uh, DranView Enterprise has a math package. This is something more towards advanced users, but uh, when you look at the Dranit's products, a lot of information is, is in the database and the voltage and the current. But once you have voltage and current, you can compute a heck of a lot of information from that if you choose to do it. Uh, you can recompute harmonics if you'd like to do that. Uh, but you can also have your own custom uh, math formulas and the math the math channel interface is very much like Excel, uh, where Excel, you can write little formulas and have uh, trigonometric functions in different things, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. You have that capability in the DranView Enterprise math package to do that. Again, this is an advanced feature, and we'll be talking about this in the last web meeting on the 24th.